It has been an incredible first week here in Tryon, North Carolina at the FEI World Equestrian Games. Unfortunately, the endurance had to be cancelled midway through the race due to a potentially dangerous combination of heat and humidity. In the team reigning, the question on everybody's lips was, could the USA be beaten? The answer was no. An outstanding performance from 18-year-old Cade McCutcheon, who posted the highest score of the day, helping Team USA secure the first gold medal of the Games. My goal coming here is to win the team gold. The individual is just extra. The team gold was my main priority and we did it. I'm very happy with In the team dressage, it was once again all about the Germans, who defended the title they won four years ago in Normandy. The eventing also got underway with the dressage phase. Julia Krauski of Germany scored 19.9 .9 in her test, the third best dressage score ever at a World Championships. In the Grand Prix special, Isabel Wirt and Bella Rose wowed the crowd and the judges with a faultless performance as she won her fourth individual World Equestrian Games gold medal. With this horse, everything is special, and, and this horse is so outstanding with everything, and uh, she is full of, uh, of energy and power and elasticity, and today I think it was just wonderful. The eventing continued with the cross-country phase, and Captain Mark Phillips's course proved a tricky one. It was a great day for the whole of the British squad, who all went clear, moving them into the gold medal position in the team standings. Ingrid Klimker of Germany went to the top of the individual standings after a gutsy clear round. But with seven riders within one penalty fence, it could all change after the show jumping. I'm really happy because Bobby did such a wonderful job. He was from the beginning very fast and really bold and I could take everything the way I wanted. He was really searching for the fences and it was a wonderful feeling. In the individual reigning competition, Bernard Fonk of Belgium wrote his own little bit of history as he became the first rider from outside of North America to win the individual title. He was just there for me like, like he is always. He's a, a super-minded horse. He's three times world champion in road in the NRHA. He is European champion three times. He's world champion now in the FEI. I need to say thank you to my wife because she's my big support. I need to say thank you to the Federation because they bring, you, bring us here. I need to say thank you to my chef, the keep. I need to say thank you to my owners. I'm, I'm really, 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 really happy. Join us for what will be a fascinating second week at the FEI World Equestrian Games from Tryon, North Carolina.